All right, give me wood. Give me wood. All right, that's enough. That's enough wood. Come on. I I'm, I can't believe I'm being chased by a chicken. Welcome to a brand new series of Pow World. This is a new kind of Pokemon survival game where we have to defeat bosses to progress through the game. Uh, it's very new. It came out like a few days ago and I'm very excited to play it. It looks very promising. It's been like blowing up the internet and I'm super excited. So far I uh, created my character and it looks a little bit like, uh, like the Ark Survival Evolved character creation. Uh, it's pretty cool. Uh, we're here in the Windswept Hills. Uh, tutorial, check the options menu with escape. Check survival guide. Okay, let's do that. So here's the game objective. Let's, what's the controls first? Uh, e is throw pow. Pals are Pokemon. Uh, Q is throw sphere. Okay, you, well, you know what? We're going to keep this uh, We're gonna keep this for later. You know what? Let's just not read any of this. Uh, open the build menu with B and select primitive workbench. And uh, open technology screen from the menu. And unlock the palace spear. So let's, uh, we need to get some wood for the workbench. Um, we need to pick up fallen branches. Okay, whoa, this looks so cool. Oh, the graphics look awesome. <gasps> there's, a, there's our first pal. <clears throat> and there's somebody over here, too. Who's this guy? Oh, we can talk to them. Hello. A castaway? Been a while since someone who didn't stink of pals washed up here. The, this island is a living hell. The people I came with aren't with us any longer. Those damn pals ate every one of them. You be careful out there. Here, take some basic supplies. You you need to toughen up a bit if you want to survive out here. Wait, the pals are enemies? They're they're like creatures? Okay, this is um I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to like that aspect of it. But look at that. You can see a lamb ball looks like a wulu or something. There's something over there. Wow. Okay, I'm I'm excited for this. What is that down there? A Chickippy or something like that. I, I think that's the chicken one. Um, all right. Well, we got our so we got some branches. What's this thing right here? Uh, fast travel. Ooh, okay. And we got a technology point for unlocking that. Okay, so I guess we can fast travel back here now whenever we want to. Let's just pick up some more wood. Uh, we need to build a primitive workbench. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's build it right next to this camp. Uh, right here next to our friendly, friendly neighborhood villager, I guess. Uh, let's see. No worker assigned. Build. There we go. Oh! Oh, look at that! It's building! We're assembling it! Okay, so next we need to open the technology screen from the menu and unlock Pal Sphere. I'm guessing that's like a Pokeball. Um, is it maybe from here? We can get ourselves a wooden club. Sure, we'll start production on that. Wow, we actually have to work on it ourselves. Jeez. Yeah, look at me with my wooden club. I'm holding it in kind of an awkward position, but you know what? Whatever. <laughs> so here's the technology tab up here. Uh, okay, so they're like blueprints. So we need to get the PAL spear, it said. I'm guessing this is the Pokeball. And the PAL box is probably like the PC. We get a chest, repair bench. Okay, let's save our points. Uh, we need to craft the PAL spear. So let's do that in here. We need Paldium fragments and some stone. Okay. Uh, stone is pretty self-explanatory. Oh, hello. Lamp ball. Are you gonna- are you friendly? Hello? How's it going? You're cute. Don't attack me, please. So what's this shiny thing over here? Is it what we're looking for? The, uh, the Paldium stuff? Here's some stone. Yeah, I figured I could just pick them up around. What is this? Oh, here's a pass sphere. Okay, oh, so we just got one right off the- uh, right off the bat. Okay. Uh, sweet, we got some red berries. I'm pretty sure we can probably eat them or something. I don't even know if hunger or thirst is, uh, even a thing in here. Maybe we can use it to uh, increase our health. I don't know, but we need to craft the pal sphere. I don't know where to get all this stuff, unless maybe we can craft it in the technology. Um, pal box. No, it doesn't look like it. What about the pal deck? Oh, it's the Pokédex. Okay, we got Lamb Ball, Cativa. That I don't even know what that thing is. <laughs> A cheeky pee. I want the cheeky pee. Is there anything else that we've discovered? I don't think so. So I think if we just see them on our screen, then they they'll register. Uh, it's kind of like the same as Pokemon, except a little bit different. Uh, but yeah, so far this is cool. We got our inventory right here. Um, a pal sphere. All right, let's let's go attack this uh, lamb uh, lamb ball right here, and uh, see what it does. Here we go. Attack! Get out of here! Oh my God! I feel so bad hurting this. Oh no! Oh the cries! Uh, you know what? Can we throw our uh, la our spear at you now? We need to throw Q, right? Oh, I think I missed. Uh, whoops. What is that down there? There's a couple things that, uh, 
that I have my eye that I have my eye on. I guess I need to create a pickaxe for that. Oh, <laughs> the lamp ball! Can I still hurt you? No. Okay. No. I mean, I didn't try that. No. What are you talking about? Pick up. What is this? Castaways journal day two. Oh, there's lore. You found a note from another adventure. Okay, we could check uh, from the options screen, I guess. What is this? A wool. We got wool. Oh, we sheared the sheep. Oh, this is so sad. Let's read the journal day two. As I explored around on foot, I found a sphere that emits a peculiar blue light. That would be the orb. I threw it without much thought, and the creature it landed near transformed into what seemed to be light, as though the sphere had absorbed it. Unbelievably, when I tried throwing the same sphere again, the creature reappeared from the light and stared at me with what seemed like an amicable expression. As I began to create a shelter to protect me from the elements, the creature astonishingly, astonishingly began to help me. How useful! Wanting to depend my connection with this living thing, I decided to name its kind Pals. To match, I christened this land. Palpago's Island. That's an awesome name for this island. All right. Well, um, there's some chicken up there. I wonder what we get if we beat the crap out of them. Okay. So I think the Paldium fragments are those little blue things that we need to mine. So we're gonna create a pickaxe and we need to hold to work. So I also created a pal box as well because it told me to. And uh, it says that if we place it down, that'll be like our base. Uh, so we're definitely gonna want to place it down. Probably not up here. We'll probably go down there like around that bridge or something and create our base there, maybe. Um, I don't know if we can move this workbench, but I mean, it only costs like, what, two wood, so it should be fine. Uh, we got a wooden club. Now we just need to create an axe, which we need stone for. We'll collect that on the way down. So um, we probably won't go back up here. Uh, but yeah, let's go and uh, create ourselves a base. I wonder if there's fall damage in this game. I don't really want to test that. So how do we equip our pickaxe? It should be like in our inventory or something. Um, yeah, here we go. Stone pickaxe. Can I, like, move it? Can I press, like, one, two, three, or something like that? E? What did I just do? Oh. Oh, that's throwing my pals. And I have no pal spheres. Um, okay, I, there's, there is a way to put this in, like, quick select or something like that. I don't know how, though. Uh, <laughs> how do I equip it? Alright, you know what? Let's go to, um, uh, let's see. Let's go to survival guide. What does it have to say here? Oh, it's scroll. Okay. Yeah, there we go. All right. That makes that makes sense. Let's just uh, get rid of this rock. Yeah, we got some palladium fragments already. All right. Now we can craft yourself a sphere and uh, catch some pals. Sweet. Let's create ourselves a base before we do that. I'm thinking right down here would be a nice spot. It's nice and open unless this is like a cave to a boss or something, which it's not. Uh, and there's something glowing green right there, too, that I want to go get as well. It's calling my name. Don't even know what it is. But let's go ahead and uh, craft. How do we craft again? Uh, build. Uh, let's craft ourselves a prim primitive workbench. I did not mean to build it there. Let's put it, like, right here, I guess, for now. And then we'll build it. And uh, hopefully we can create ourselves an axe. But that's not important right now. We can craft ourselves a pal sphere. How many can we craft? Just one? Oh, because we only have three stone. All right, well, this better work then. So what should we catch first? Should we catch a sheep, a chicken, or a cat? Uh, I kind of want... I kind of want the cat, actually. Uh, so let's go ahead. Let's. Where's our club? There it is. So we need to weaken him. Hopefully they won't fall in the water. Yeah, here we go. Oh, look at them. It's a cativa. All right, get over here. Hey, stop running from me. It knows. <laughs> Get out of here. Stop. Stop running. Stop in the name of law. Just picked up another pal sphere, too. We can't catch the cats. Come on, man. Oh, they're scared of me. Probably because I'm running at them with a club. All right. Well, you know what? Chicken it is. We'll catch the higher level one. There we go. So are they going to hurt me? I guess when they go back like that, that means they're stunned. And now this one's attacking me. Okay. Well, I don't want you. I could catch you, but I don't want you. I want to catch this one. So grow. Uh, did that do anything? I, or do I need, uh, I don't know. It just says press Q. Okay, can I get my spear back? No? What the heck? How do I, how do I catch a pal? Okay, so I just crafted another couple of pal spheres. I, I don't know if I have to throw them at them or near them. I wonder if they need to, like, land or something. Let me throw it right here or something. Would that work? No? It, press Q maybe? Uh, I don't know. Let, let me let me look at the inventory again. Let me look at a uh, option. No, not options. Uh, survival guide. Let me see. What is it? Uh, pals maybe? Uh, I don't know. You can only carry up to five pals at a time. If uh, if you capture more, they're automatically sent. Uh, capturing pals. 
Press Q. Reduce a pal's HP. Afflict it with a status effects. Okay, so basically the same as Pokemon. Um, you can also increase your chances by sneaking up on it and throwing a sphere from behind. Okay. So like right here, I don't even know how that would make a difference. Let me, let me, let me try uh, doing it from like back here or something. Throw it straight at it. Does that work? Um, I don't know if it worked. Oh, we can move the chicken's body around. Oh, that's, oh man. So wait, is it dead now? Maybe that's why. Maybe I just have to weaken them and then throw them. Maybe that's why. All right, let me craft another pal sphere and let me attack another chicken and see if it works, you know, without killing them. All right, there's some chickens here. We're gonna attack you. We might have to kill one of them. So we're gonna weaken it a little bit, like right here. Okay, there we go. All right, you know what? We're just gonna kill this one right here, uh, just because the other one's attacking me. Okay, this is good. This is good. Throw the pal sphere. I have none available. I, I thought it said I did. Oh god. Okay. Uh, <laughs> create a pal sphere. I did not craft another one because it said I had I had one available. Um, but I mean, I guess I didn't. I need wood. No. Uh, I did craft an axe though. Did I? Yes, I did. Okay, I could just literally like. Just chop a tree. Where's this chicken? Oh, it's just over there. I like the music, the battle music. All right, give me wood, give me wood. All right, that's enough. That's enough wood. Come on. I I'm, I can't believe I'm being chased by a chicken. Craft, 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 craft. He's coming right at me. No. Okay, acquire. Okay, throw the pal sphere. Oh, yes, there we go. We got a new uh, loadout here. Yeah, there we go. Oh, okay. Nice. So we just got ourselves a chickpea. Uh, extremely weak and far too delicious. It is one of the weakest pals alongside lamb ball. No matter how many are hunted, they just keep appearing. And press E to summon them. Okay. There we go. We got ourselves chickpea. Yay. Egg layer. Don't know what that is. Uh, but, you know what? It's fine. Sometimes it lays an egg when assigned to ranch. Oh, that's its skill. Okay, so if we assign it to a ranch, then we can get eggs. Oh, that's cool. I'm going to catch more. So the tutorial says to build a pal box. This will be our base right here. So let's do it. I guess we could do it like right next to the crafting station, maybe. Uh... We just build it from here, right? Yeah, here we go. It'll take 10 seconds. Oh my. Look at that whole thing go up. Jeez. How big is this? Oh my god. Okay, so the pal box uh, can summon pals to our base. So that's probably what the chicken's rancher ability can be. Uh, pal box management menu. Okay, so this is also our Pokemon box. Let's put uh, this chicken at the base. There we go. Uh, take out a pal at base and they'll automatically search for jobs. And what they're capable of doing. Okay, so that one should just lay eggs. Working a little slow, probably a slacker. He's got a minor injury. Pals without beds will get stressed. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, so use tab to open inventory and, and uh, consume food. Star, uh, stab off hunger. So let's uh, eat the red berries. How do we do that? Consumable, do we just put in our food? Requires small feed bag. Oh my god, this is so confusing. Oh, hello, lamb doll. Uh, our lamb ball. Wait, do we have any, uh, spheres? No, we don't. But we can craft one, right? I need to catch a lamb ball. How many can we craft? We craft five! Alright, sweet, let's just do that. Alright, lamb ball. You're mine! Get beaten up by a club, sucker! Okay! Oh, it is almost dead. And we captured it. Capture it 100%. Nice! Alright, so that's two out of three down. A walk up a hill, uh, tends to end with this pal tumbling back down. This causes it become... Uh, to become dizzy and unable to move, making it easy to capture kill. As a result, it stumbled down to the very bottom of something I didn't get to read the rest of that. Um, but nice, we got an XP bonus for first capture. Okay, uh, we need to capture five lamb balls for the quest. Um, we also have some technology stuff we need to do. Like we need a, uh, what, a food sack, right? Or something like that. Can we craft that? Or uh, unlock the crafting? I don't think so. I, d I don't, at least I don't see it here. Alright, we know what, let's create a campfire. Uh, wooden chest, repair bench, I'm getting hungry, wooden structure, old bow, and some arrows. Uh, we need a bed, straw pal bed, we'll get that too, repair kit. We're just wasting all of our technology points. Cloth, I feel like that'll be useful. Uh, common shield, stone sphere, cloth outfit, okay. Uh, feed box, let's get a feed box and uh, a cloth outfit. I think those will probably be the most useful. And... Uh, I don't know, we can, uh, let's not learn any of those. Let's save our stuff. We got a pal our pal deck updated. We need to catch a cativa. Um, I hear, I hear cats. I think they're over there. I'm hungry. How do we eat? Oh, there we go. I figured it out. Okay, yeah, we can eat food for us. And our hunger's the orange bar. We can feed lamb, lamb ball, too. That doesn't heal their health. I don't think so, anyway. All right. Uh, strengthen my stats. I'm trying to finish the tutorial. Here we go. Enhance stats. 
Oh, okay. So, uh, let's see. How many stat points do we have? We have three. So, let's increase our weight. Oh, my God. That increased it by a lot. Let's increase our HP and our stamina for now. There we go. I think that's fine for now. Try and keep it balanced. All right. Uh, build up your base until it reaches level seven. Increase your player level by capturing 30 pals and capture five land balls. All right. Well, we will do this, all this in the next video. The last thing I want to do today is see what this little green thing is. Uh, before I do anything else. I guess this line right here is my base, uh, border. So I, I want to see what this is. Whoa! Dinosome! I hope they're not a gre- Oh, they're a boss. I can see the little score right there. Um, maybe they're protecting that. Okay, maybe I won't go over there this time. Uh, maybe I'll, I'll have to level up all of my, uh, my pals and, uh, work my way up there. Unless maybe I could swim across, maybe? I mean, I can climb walls in this game. Let me try, uh, just swimming across like this. I want to know what this is. Yeah, here we go. This seems to be working. Uh, there we go. Just climb up this. What is this? Pick up. It is Lift Monk Effigy. Uh, uh, collect them and offer them to a statue of power to improve your ability to capture pals. Oh, cool. All right. So they're like, uh, Pokeball upgrades a little bit. I, I'm guessing. I don't know... A hundred percent about this game. I don't know everything. What is that? I didn't even see that before. Oh, that looks cool All right Well, I'm super excited to progress to this game and uh, build up my base a little bit capture more pals and discover more But guys if you enjoyed this video then go ahead and leave a like on it If you want to see another one you can also subscribe to the channel see some more content just like this It's absolutely free and you won't miss a thing. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Bye